You know, it's been almost an entire year since what was formerly known as Blue Collar Wrestling came into existence and they had wrestlers from all over, not just the Northwest, had guys come up from California, had guys come in from Utah, guys from Washington, all coming in at first to Hood River, then at Tigard. Everybody, everybody wanted it on it because it was so new. And it didn't matter who it was. It could have been as old as Tex Thompson, as young as Aiden Reyes. Um, it didn't matter. The biggest, the baddest, the best, they all came in. But from day one, one man controlled blue collar wrestling, which is what is now white collar wrestling. And that man is the BCW heavyweight champion, Keith Atkins. From day one of its existence, I have been running the show. White Collar Incorporated has my back. And now I have Tommy Celsius's controlling interest in the company. The Bulldog from Canada, last month you got in my face a little too much. You want to fight with lawyers, White Collar Incorporated's got the lawyers, but you dare get in the ring with me, get in my face. You saw what happened. For an entire year, I have been that champion. And any other challenger, anybody on that card that wanted to come and get a piece of me was lying on his back for the one, two, three count. Now, coming up May 14th. The Tiger Grange, 6 o'clock bell time. I'm going to be conducting business as only Keith Atkins can conduct business. I'm the head of White Collar Incorporated. I am the head of BCW. I am the BCW champion. And as far as competition goes, there is none, but somebody's going to get their ass kicked on the 14th. Now, last month, bad blood, you took advantage of an incident involving somebody else with White Collar Incorporated. And their mistake gave you number one contender to my heavyweight title. Sucks being you, sucks being the number one contender, because I send them all back anyway. As far as employees who don't meet the high standards I set for them in White Collar Incorporated, and you know who you are, you will be dealt with accordingly. Bad blood, you you should have stayed in your hood. You should have been happy with your bling and chilling in your crib. But instead, instead, you've got a title shot against me, the number one contender. Now, due to certain circumstances, which I 
had absolutely nothing to do with. You might be mysteriously missing from the Tiger Grange Hall on May 14th. That would be a shame. That would also be a shame for that little tag team of painfully large who keeps getting in my business. It'd be a shame if they were there all alone without you. It'd be a shame if they had to feel the wrath of White Collar Incorporated with bad blood mysteriously not being there. Of course, I'm getting ahead of myself. I'm sure you've got it in your planner to make the appointment, but for some reason, if you weren't there, it might be very bad for painfully large might also be very bad for White Collar Incorporated's newest employee, Tommy Celsius. See, you thought you were clever last show, but I've got an extra special surprise for you this Saturday at the Tiger Grange when Tommy Celsius actually wrestles Tommy Celsius. There are more surprises to come. Because anybody that gets in my way gets crushed the white-collar way. And it sucks being you.